We've heard it all before. If you don't buckle up, you could get a ticket. But in Williamson County, the constables there have found a new way to enforce the law without even driving the streets. KXAN's Katina McHenry joins us live with this story tonight. Katina. Leslie, Williamson County Constable spent the morning at the high traffic intersection of Toll Road 45 and Palmer Lane. Instead of driving the streets this year, they decided to do something different and actually hit the streets on foot. They decided to set up posts in the median instead of in their police units. I have four. Right. You may have thought it was a joke or he was begging for money. You're not going to get a ticket, okay? Just make sure you wear your seatbelt. Okay, all right. Dressed in plain clothes, holding a homemade click it or ticket sign, claiming he was a cop. We have six no seatbelts right now. It wasn't a joke. Because uh, we're pulling over people who don't have their seatbelts on. I'm, a, I'm really a cop. Williamson County Constable Robert Chody spent his morning pacing up and down in the median at Palmer and 45, peering into each vehicle whizzing by, looking for lawbreakers. There are still 45 million people, approximately, that do not wear seatbelts across the U.S., which really just blew me away when I saw that. Once a driver was spotted not wearing a seatbelt... Okay, it looks like a uh, pickup a truck. Uh, so it's going to be the last one, no seatbelt. Turning left now, Rob. He radioed ahead to one of his four deputies who would then pull the driver over and issue a ticket. Hey, man, I'm swearing. It's your driver's license, please. One driver pulled over today can understand the seriousness of the program. Having been injured herself from not wearing a seatbelt, today she wears it in memory of a classmate that was recently killed. And he flew right through the windshield and hit his head and he just snapped his neck and got killed. Certainly seatbelts save, save lives. It's not a guarantee, but it certainly reduces the risk of someone getting seriously hurt or even killed. Well, officers also issued other tickets today for violations of speeding, expired inspection stickers, and even running red lights. They issued a total of 21 tickets today. Nine of those were for seatbelt violations, costing drivers $140 each. Reporting live in downtown Austin, Katina McHenry, KXAN Austin News.